headshot. Trump just responded to Kathy Griffin and gave her the worst news of her life. This was just sick. We all saw the sick thing that D-list comedian Kathy Griffin did yesterday. She posted a sick video of herself posing with a video of a severed head on social media. She was forced to apologize immediately. She did in this very lame apology video, which you can watch below. Can you spot her rolling her eyes in it? Hey everybody, it's me, Kathy Griffin. I sincerely apologize. I am just now seeing the reaction of these images. I'm a comic. I cross the line. I move the line, then I cross it. I went way too far. The image is too disturbing. I understand how it offends people. It wasn't funny. I get it. I've made a lot of mistakes in my career. I will continue. I ask your forgiveness. Taking down the image, I'm going to ask the photographer to take down the image, and I beg for your forgiveness. I went too far. I made a mistake, and I was wrong. Kathy Griffin tweeted out, I am sorry. I went too far. I was wrong. Does she mean it, though? My children, especially my 11-year-old son, Baron, are having a hard time with this. Sick. Trump tweeted, can you believe that Trump's son watched that? Kathy Griffin should be ashamed of herself. My children, especially my 11-year-old son, Baron, are having a hard time with this. Sick. Kathy Griffin is losing a lot of work because that shameless picture that she posted. She is starting to lose sponsorships as we speak. Why is it that leftists think they can do this crap? You know you messed up when Squatty Potty pulls the plug. Squatty Potty released releases statement in response to controversial photo shoot by Kathy Griffin. St. George of Utah, May 30th. Considering Kathy Griffin's recent controversial photo shoot, Squatty Potty would like to clarify her relationship with the company. Kathy Griffin is not nor ever has been Squatty Potty's spokesperson. She was hired to make one commercial. Squatty Potty has pulled said commercial as well as other promotional and marketing content featuring Kathy Griffin. While we respect an individual's right to express political views, we feel her choice to express those views violently was done in poor taste and does not reflect our company culture or brand identity, said Dan Duchester, director of e-commerce. Wow. The July 22nd performance by Kathy Griffin has been canceled at the casino. Wow. This shouldn't stop here. This is disgusting that Trump's young son had to see this sick crap. CNN is currently evaluating, keeping her right now to cover their New Year's Eve coverage, but have made no decisions at this point, says Daily Mail. Donald Trump Jr. tweeted, Dear at CNN, I must have missed your statement banning your commentator, Kathy Griffin, from future shows. Please resend. Thanks. Here is what CNN currently says. We found what she did disgusting and offensive. We are pleased to see she has apologized and asked that the photos be taken down. We are evaluating New Year's Eve and have made no decision at this point. Let's send CNN a message about this, Patriots. Please do the following two steps. One, share this if you think CNN should drop Kathy Griffin. Two, comment, fire Kathy Griffin below this post. Wow, this is, uh, you know, I mean, let's send a message that we the people are tired of the ISIS-inspired propaganda videos that the left is putting out now. I mean, it, it, you know, I'm at a loss for words. I mean, such a stupid move on her part, really, professionally. What a stupid move. Didn't anybody that was around her taking the pictures 
tell her, you know, like this is like too risque to put up? I don't know. I mean, this is like really very serious, very serious. Let us know what you think in the comments below and thank you so much for watching.